Congratulations on your pregnancy. Oh, thank you. That's awesome. I was just going to ask how that's been affecting training right now. If, if it is, if it is at all, it is a lot, um, more so because I just am not really motivated to train in a way that's like a professional athlete in just because I'm not training for anything. So mainly my goals right now are just to stay healthy, stay in contact with like all the components of triathlon. So still do strength and swim, bike and run, but at a lot less of a um, intense way. And really like my coach, Joel Filial, he hasn't given me a program basically since I told him like we were expecting and I've just been doing what I want to do and what, what is fun and kind of taking this time as like a mental and physical break in a way, even though everything I do, even though it's not very much feels way harder. So it doesn't really feel like a a physical break, but uh, it, it is. And I think that that'll just make me like stronger coming back. Actually, Jackie um, from Jackie Herring from actually your area, I talked to her really early on in my pregnancy to get some advice from her because um, she obviously has two kids and she's just come back even stronger from those Mm -hmm. pregnancies. And one of her, like, that was a bit of her advice to me was just a, like, take this time to do what's fun and what, what I want to, what my body wants to do. And then be, when I come back, take my time and not rush into it just so I can be fully ready. You know, I I imagine coming off the, the past year you had with a lot of challenging situations and then also the Olympics thrown in there that a a mental break is probably well deserved. Yeah, it's it's been a while. So I think since I started triathlon, this is, this is my first extended break. And I mean, I guess I have, I've only been doing triathlon since 2013, but in a pretty intense all in way since then. So this is the first time I've been home. Like we actually have a home and, um, it's, it's been different, but in a nice way, like it's enjoyable to me that I get to spend time with family and friends and don't have to feel like I'm missing out on a training session or not preparing in the right way for a particular race or event. And, um, I actually can just like have some quality time. And actually I went to a camp a couple of weeks ago in Claremont, Florida and helped Tommy, my husband with his new job as the talent ID coordinator for USA triathlon. So it was working with a lot of athletes who were in the same situation I was in 2013, they were going into their first triathlons and trying to get their pro card. And I got to be a part of that. And I was like, wow, this is something I wouldn't be able to do if it weren't for this year. 